Today we try to do, do this every day. Wanda Escobar is angry and frustrated. She says the final straw was Sunday night. She was watching TV on her couch with her partner who's living with disabilities in a wheelchair. She heard what she says sounded like a river behind her couch. In just a matter of minutes, she says her kitchen started to flood. Sometimes I cry because I'm getting mad because I see my partner crying every day. Escobar says it's not the first time, but this latest water fiasco was the worst. It was so bad, she says, take a look at her lobby. It was flooded there, too. Oh, my goodness, it's dripping everywhere. Fulashade Olatunde showed us the damage done. It's even dripping from the light. Olatunde lives in the same building here at the Mott Haven houses in the Bronx. She says leaks have been a chronic issue. They want people to pay their rent, but people are suffering in their homes. Back to Escobar's kitchen where she continues to mop. She says she called management and they told her she would have to wait for a plumber. How long, she doesn't know. PIX11 News reached out to NYCHA about Escobar's situation and repairs needed in the lobby, and a NYCHA spokesperson tells us some good news. Quote, the leaks affecting these residents were caused by a broken waistline that was addressed by a temporary repair. NYCHA plumbers are currently on site to make a permanent fix. Escobar says she has us on speed dial and hopes this fix will be the last so she can finally put away her mop for good.